how are you measuring cost? Because to provide one stream requires the whole internet and everything. So it's like super expensive if you think of it, this as a single system. Yeah, I'm still objecting. Like, I, I but if you like, if you have an open network out there, and you're like, okay, you're trying to negotiate with all the companies in the world, and you're like, I have a connection to an ISP near me. They're not super like uh, voracious. They're not going to steal a ton from me. What does it cost me each day to hear one thousand one megabyte clips and then speak? 100 five megabyte audio clips like what does it actually cost running through the cheapest providers to send out 105 megabyte clips not fucking not a fraction of thousands of dollars it costs like maybe a quarter a quarter would be good to cover you for 105 megabyte clips sent at your leisure right like you're not you are saying shit ahead of time no there's no watching you will download a model of, of our face. I will only send you my facial animation data. Fuck that shit. We, you will have a model of me if you're my friend. And if you want to have a better model of you, then become my friend and I will send you a better model. And all I will send you is my voice and my facial animation. And that's fucking it. Fuck that. We don't, and I don't even think that's, I think the pipes are empty anyways. Like if we have something and we need data, we'll just fucking pay for it. Everybody else pays for it. We'll pay for it. That's not the limiting factor. It's not that expensive. They all do it. And Twitch doesn't even produce anything. Like they don't tap into their creator's creativity and like invent shit or like they just ads and, and a vague, right? Like it's ridiculous. It's an old school. Right, it's, it's I mean, it's, it, it makes sense, you know, if you think of capitalism, like, what would they do? They would do whatever the fuck makes them money. It's, you know, it's expected that it's going to happen, but that's because of the structure. I mean, Twitch didn't appear via, like, a white paper available to the general public, right? Twitch appeared as a small business, you know, shopped to venture capitalists to, to, as a way to suck money out of people. You want like a great, if you want a great Twitch, which is called Twatch, you've got to publish a compelling story in a white paper and get like 250,000 people around the world to be like, listen, even if nobody else uses this, like we have 250,000 extra motherfuckers. We don't need any more than that, right? Like we don't need you people. We don't need every fucking geek in the world. I only have 25 friends on Discord, right? So like get rid of... We could build something different and bring in a small number and all I gotta do is publish a white paper. That's that that's it. If the combination of words is right, they will give they will send you fucking crypto and and you build a company. I mean, yes, most of them are scams, so you gotta get past that, but people are dying for crypto not scams. They love like a great new network. And if and if you have a high standard for your people, like you fine, but it can it can it can it can be a minor part of something very awesome that gets all the crypto knights to say, you know what, I'm over crypto, but this is still what it exists for. You know what? No, no. Well, like, no. For now, maybe, but like we, we, we're looking to build a Knight Riders blockchain. Like we, we want to put information out there that stays out there. I mean, it can branch, right? But where the original branches stay there for history. Like we're trying to write shit in the fucking history that's immutable. We're trying to be like, we told you so, right? Like we will tell you what the future will look like when we get our shit together. And, and we won't.
Other, other than a few countries, Are you high? Well, he's high because, like, we were we were talking about something else. This is more regular crypto talk. We were on something, I know, but we were building something. Theoretic. We don't know. We're too, you can't know something that you're in the process of creating. Right? You can't know what hasn't even been fucking created yet. Then calm the fuck down. Of course I'm high, because I was not talking to you. We don't even get along that well. Stephanus and I are having a bit of a renaissance conversationally, and, and you are trained by moderating a politics server to interact in a way, or interlock you in a way that can be difficult. Plus, you don't think that I'm, plus you don't think I'm a brilliant person. You think I'm a retard, so you are, we weren't arguing at all. Like Mike came, Mike, Mike had that tone. Sorry, Mike, but you had a bit of a tone. We were very friendly and we don't know what, right? Cause you don't, you don't, you don't respect me. You don't esteem me, right? You don't think I'm a genius because you are a closed minded hater. Not at all. I don't, I, how can I respect someone who doesn't respect me? I'm a, I'm a hardworking, honest, brilliant guy. You treat me like a retard, go fuck yourself. You constantly tell, you constantly, my only problem with you is what you think about me. I judge people by how they judge me. I, I, I'm just myself. I'm just myself. I'm, I'm me. I'm me. I'm me. And I judge people by what they think of me. I'm honest as fuck. I'm a real person. Um, and you don't like me, so I don't like you. It's kind of like Trump, except for I'm, I'm, like, I'm the guy who said white lives matter. The truth fucking matters to me. I am genuine. I am smart as fuck. I do give a fuck about you. You have had a perspective on me that is similar to a lot of normie fucks. And you're not a normie fuck, but you have a perspective that a crowd has had. And all the objective evidence says you're wrong. It says I'm, I am who I say I am. And you look at me like a dumb, disingenuous Negatrol fuck, and none of that's true. It's not true. None of those things are true. I'm not a negatrol. I'm not fucking stupid. If I if I troll people, I control you. I try to do it to make you laugh. It never fucking works with you. That's not my fault. That's not my fault. I care what people think. I don't care what you think about anymore. The light the light controls the gas lightning. I'm Investe Monsanto. Mike, Mike, I'm sorry. I don't have a problem with you other than that you think I'm like nobody and nothing. And I've worked for 25 years for no pay, trying to be the best person I could be as one of the most blessed people I've ever met. And you look upon me negatively. You don't laugh at my jokes. I, that doesn't have to be my fault. You're not perfect either, right? And do you think I really just said that? No, 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 no. It's what you say. It's what you say. I'm a whole shit. If you're right, if you're right, I'm a whole shit, right? If, if you're right, I'm a whole shit. I'm not a piece. I'm the fucking whole shit. So just say that. Just call me a whole. No, we were talking. We were talking about a game. We were talking about a game. We were talking about a nonprofit game. I was talking to Steph He can't stop Stephanus because he'll realize we were talking about something real. We're talking about a game, something beautiful. Like I've worked for decades and you just come in here with your, I'm a mod on a politics server. I am the, uh, Mike, you are, we, we don't get, a, we, 
we, we don't get along and we both, I guess, maybe blame one another, right? We, I, don't, I don't think we're... You weren't even in here. You weren't even in here. We were, no, we were in a small room. We, we were in a small room. We were in a small room where we've been for years having a nice conversation, right? You go, you go in rooms where there's more people into bigger groups of motherfuckers and you don't deal, you don't deal well with, with true, you don't deal well with, with true alpha motherfuckers. You don't deal well with big, with truly big brains. Like, But it's not for crypto. It, it, we, we weren't there though, right? We're not making game for crypto. Crypto is a part of something, right? The central feature of what we're doing is not crypto, right? Of course, but it's a fucking tool, right? And we do want to write shit into history, immutable shit into history. Mike doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about when it comes to me. I respect him when it comes to most other subjects where he doesn't have some kind of fucking outrage, but it's not, a, it's not about crypto. It's about, it's about freedom and creativity and you're boring and you're and you're like a normie com like I wasn't I would you 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 came into a room I avoid the banana when I go into rooms because you don't get along with me lately at all I don't I don't click into the banana room you clicked into here I saw you in another room I'm like I'm not probably gonna go in one of the reasons Mike doesn't like me I'm gonna say things and even if they're good he's gonna take them with a negative perspective enough because I create things but it but the but because I'm an artist, I'm an artist and an inventor who works with words, and he thinks I'm a piece of shit. I, I because I don't because I don't have to make money. That's why because I don't have to make money. I don't lie about anything. Name one thing. Name one thing. I talk. I talk shit to you, and all my friends to their face. I talk shit to people to their face. I talk shit to people to their face. You're a spaz as fuck. You're small brain right now. Period. No, that's the truth. I'm all in that relatively speaking, you're not, you're not using your highest mind. You're not using your highest mind. You're using your shit mind. This is your dark, shitty mind. Yeah, because you just burst in here and interrupted to talk traditionally. He's so annoying. So gay. He's so fucking gay. Oh my God. I don't mean like sexually. I mean like platonically. Like, sorry. So gay. I'd rather suck a dick. I'd rather suck a dick than have a converse. I'd rather suck a dick and swallow cum than have a conversation with Mike. I don't hate him, but he's worthless to me. Like he looks down on me like he's fucking something. It's fine. He's not going to create anything. He, he likes to talk with people and, and feel like on a wide range of subjects, he knows what he's talking about. That's all like, everybody's got their own little insecurities. Mike isn't fucking building anything. He's not really passionate about anything. He wants to fit in and have a good time with his friends. That's not me. I love my friends, but I'm, I'm not going to sacrifice who I am to fit in with you people. We can... I don't, I mean, I, I'm very anti-advertising. I do believe that one of the things we will do if we build a great network is we will write and draw and animate so much shit, right? And when we turn towards the world and we share that shit, it will kind of look like advertisements, right? They'll be like, this is beautiful things created by this network that draws attention to them, right? But like, it's not, it's, I mean, so it is, it is, it is. I gotta, I gotta think about how to explain this perfectly. How, Cause they are ads, like the, it's like myriads, right? They are a kind of ad because they come from us. They, because they come from our artistic collective. They advertise our collective and each one of them, each piece of art kind of, it draws it, advertises some specific piece of the world of art that, that we've created. So it's kind of like, sometimes it's like, is this art or is this business? Well, if you create a great piece of art that happens to contain something you love that is real, and it makes that thing become real, well, that's part of our extraordinary story. People do that. They create ads that turn into reality, right? And that's the goal, really.
you create an ad, which is like it's short for adventure, right? You create an adventure that turns into a fucking legitimate business that does good. And because the technology we have, we can do this for 1,000th the price of prototyping in reality. Maybe a 10,000th, like one over a myriad. That's how much we have to pay to like simulate things before we all start throwing all of our extra money into crazy projects. I'm sorry, Mike is annoying. What, like what? No, not, but like if I lie, what do you think? What, what do you think I lie about? Cause like you're on the call and he's like, you're a liar. Like what is it that I, do you know something that I lie about? Cause I would love to find this out. Like I don't have to, so why? Like if I do, I'm doing it by choice and I'm a fucking scum. But like, obviously I talk shit to Mike and I talk shit to Lamor and I talk shit, to everybody fucking talk shit. And I talk more shit uh, to their friends. And like Mike, maybe Mike can't handle it. I don't think I'm sharing anyone else's lies. Like, I mean, shit, a lot of what we talk about is ideas and beliefs. I'm gonna like lie about an idea that I don't have or <laughs> Oh, just an ingenue. What's an ingenue? That's a thing, right? Ingenue? Ingenue. Is that the word? That's like, um, it's like a ingenue. Is that the word? Ingenue. An innocent or unsophisticated young woman, especially in a player film. Disingenue. Interesting. I mean, that could be fun, right? You meet an innocent, unsophisticated woman and she's beautiful and you're not a bad guy. You're just like, thank you, universe. This is, this is going to be fun. I will treat her respectfully, but thank you for letting me meet her at this time and place. Play some pipe. So, sorry. Um, fucking Mike. I'm still. I'm still upset about Mike. Right. And if you do it, you think other people do it, right? Like Trump, Trump would steal an election, therefore he believes other people would. He, like if you lie, you expect other people will lie. I don't expect that lie. I don't really know what he's talking about. I'm particularly a pussy because I like sort of have lived a life where I never had to lie. Like one time I went to jail for like a night because I, I didn't lie, but I never had, I never had to, right? Like if you don't have to lie, why fucking do it? I mean, but I understand everybody lies, right? Like, oh. yeah, but I, I think a lot, a lot more of it's jokes, right? A lot more of it's just fucking jokes. You're not like... I think. So, so on my stream, on my on my stream, I wrote what what I think you could be called. Then, unlike Trump, Trump's a, Trump is a real piece of shit. You might be a fake piece of shit. Like you just play, you just play, you just play a piece of shit sometimes. Wasn't talking to you, stray fuck, ban stray, stray ban. Stray ban, activate. He should be stray ban from the wagon. I'm gonna burn this kid to a crisp like I'm a fucking dragon. Fucking Bilbo, but you're like Bilbo, fucking, you're like Dildo Baggins. You fucking suck out Bilbo's Yeah. <laughs>
Yeah, what do you like? That nice vivisect Ram Ramaswamy. I bet you like, I know, because you're, uh, you know a lot of shit. You got, oh, see, Savannah's, I've also disrespected Savannah's, but, but he laughs. laughs. But they don't get, they don't even, they can't handle jokes. Like, they don't get it. Like, they don't get it. Like, you can't hate somebody like Stray or Mike. You can't hate a retard. You can't hate an unfortunate first world problem child bitch. Like, you don't hate them. You make jokes about them so you can tolerate. <laughs> Oh my God, Stephanus, it's not like that's objectively inaccurate, right? Like if you really look at me or Stray or Mike, like we are first world problem children cunts. Like seriously, like if I can call me it, who gives a fuck what you think? No, hold on, I have to come back to this guy's, I'm literally being disrespected by a weasel. Hold on. Like a straight up, like a fascist weasel is just going crazy. And I was just trying to talk to Stephanus. Uh, you gotta go, you gotta go. It, it's cool. Yeah, you gotta go landscape though. Um, that's a huge. I don't want to talk to you or Mike. Shut your fucking pie hole. Dude. Strike, I gotta ask you a question. It's not it's not your fault, Strike. Strike, it's not your fault, but no no, no no, strength. It's not your fault, but how many people in your life? No. I'm not trying to. Strike, strike, strike. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Savannah, hold on. Hold on, Savannah. Strike, we weren't talking, we weren't we're not talking to you. I'm not, no, I'm saying how many people, so this is a real question, it's a real question, dude, this is an American conversation, it's an Amer, hey, it's an America. it's an, no, 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 we weren't, we weren't, we weren't, we weren't, we weren't, this is an American conversation, this is an American conversation, how many people in your life, how many times have you been called a genius, real conversation, this is America, I can ask whatever the fuck I want, how many times in your life has another person, even including the jokes, called you a genius? You you are a you are a right wing sympathizer. Like I don't even really identify with the left. You actively identify with ridiculous, insane, hyperbolic, insecure, disingenuous, fake shit. You're bored with life. You're mad. Nah, he's decent. I it, like he's decent. He could make. He, he's not, he's not gonna make him. I mean, yeah, but if he. But you have, if you can't sell any of them and you're doing it to make money, it's kind of like, it's kind of fucked, right? I'm saying if you're, make, if you're making them to sell, not to be an artist. All right. I mean, you, you are a, a visual artist. I don't want to make 40 paintings. Painting used to be a, a, a technology that was great for creating shit that didn't exist, right? Like that's, that was like the leading edge of inventing something and showing someone an image of it. Yeah, but he's he's just he's just he's just laughing like a weasel and and using his decent skills to create paintings that he wants to sell to make money. It's not really art, right? Like it's just it's not really art. It's business and it's Uh -huh. Um, stray, 
See, Savannah, she had this. I am, I am, I am a blessed, blessed motherfucker. I mean, I've suffered, but I'm a blessed motherfucker in a blue state because of you. You're part of the reason why I'm actually blue MAGA. Like literally, I'm blue MAGA because of like you. You're, I don't think you hate people or anything. You're on the nice side of the right wing. Like you're barely like you're not in like an alt right, right? You don't you don't believe, you're not part of the alt right, are you? Have you ever even I don't have to. I just you just take over the conversation and do the same thing and then I just realize you don't there's nothing real you want to talk about. No, but you've talked for years, haven't you? Haven't you mentioned, haven't you talked for, haven't you talked for years? I'm just saying you, you are, I am, I am not far, far left by traditional understanding. I'm near left and you're near right. And you've talked for years also. I don't, I haven't heard an idea that I want to fucking support. The right, as far as I understand, doesn't have a lot of ideas. Remember, the, the, the left isn't right, right? This is me saying, I'm left. The left isn't right, right? The left isn't right, right? But the right, I'm not done, but the right, but, but the right is wrong. The left isn't right, but the right is wrong. It's wrong. You don't need fascists. You don't need strongmen. You don't need tiny, you don't need tiny government. You don't need Jesus. You don't need nationalism. You don't need any of that shit. No, I'm pr pretty much pro-life. Like I, I don't go out. Like I think that it, I'm honest about it. You are, you are, you are killing a human being. From in my opinion, that's the one thing. But that's how many people, but who, who are they and where did you learn that? Like it's some schools, some extreme. I, I have no, unless I hear something like not from, unless I hear something truly dangerous, like I have nothing to do with that. If I think people are truly being threatened, if it rises to the top of the injustices in the, yeah, I don't give a fuck because it's not a big injustice. It doesn't matter. Half the, no, no, I said the left isn't right. It begins with saying the left isn't right. The left isn't right, but the right is wrong, right? The left, is, the left isn't right, right? But the left, but the right is wrong, right? No, that's crazy to say. The center, the center isn't even a fucking thing. The left, the, the right says the past is better and the left says the future is better. There's a lot of weird ways to address. The, 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 the right says smaller government. The left says bigger government. The, the left says spread the power. The right says pick a, a, an individual strong man because you get more efficiency with a good strong man because the network of people doesn't even fucking exist. The left network, collective networks don't even exist yet, really. Right? You, you do want a strong man. You want a Trump. You want somebody to guide the system, someone to rise to the top and be an alpha and guide the system and make good military. You don't believe that even communitarians and the people of the world should have a fucking say. They should have human rights. We should think of this planet globalistically and, and protect human rights in a way that does not line up with what you say. You care about American rights only. You only care about American rights. You only care about American rights. I care about huma human rights and humane rights. You care about American rights. Because you are lucky enough to be fucking born here. That's what you care about. Not human rights. American rights. American rights. I think you probably, I think you want to, do you want to open the border? Do you want to open the border? You've talked for years. Do you want to open the border or do you want to close it? Do you have any ideas? Do you, do you have, is there a, is, oh God, how? What's that system? It takes a ton of fucking words. Like what, what, and. I don't want to hear your normie opinion on this. Pass, Savannah, grant me a pass. 
You don't have a, I'm not hearing, you heard this somewhere, like whatever, maybe it's, maybe it's right in your fucking, in your paradigm. We should accept every immigrant in the fucking world, every family that wants to escape, we should accept, shut the fuck up, you don't know what you're talking about. We should give them Nebraska, you fucking idiot. We should go, we should go humane and shut up, you don't think for a living. You draw Mickey Mouse to try to sell it and buy a car. Fuck off. You don't train your brain. You don't think in philosophical or ethical terms. You are drawing Mickey Mouse to make money and it's not your fault. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. Get hijab, cover your face, get hijab. Get a head covering like you're a fucking Muslim wo woman. Get hijab, you hater fuck. And that's a joke, you dumb hater fuck. Get hijab. Dude, Stefanis, if he comes on my show, I'm going to make him wear a fucking hijab. I don't think he hates generally. I do think sometimes he fucking hates me. Sorry, I think you would close the border. You would close the border. <laughs> you, Stray, you would close the border. I would accept 50 million families and give them Nebraska and let them build the greatest city the world has ever fucking seen. And you're like, oh my God, they're going to come and they're going to rape my wife because of Trump, right? Pe mobs, don't, mobs don't form, mobs shut, I was talking, shut the fuck up. I'm allowed to put words in your mouth. This is a perfect example of a conversation between a good liberal, a good liberal, and a random, pissed off uh, conservative. I I could run. I could start running right now to be the commander and chief executive of the disintegrated states of Central North America. Fuck you, Trump broke the glass. Trump, I want to run just to piss off Stray. <laughs> I'll use Stray as my, like, Stray will talk shit, and I'll run for president just because I'm mad that Stray said I'm not even a man. <laughs> oh, my God. Turn it landscape, ass fucker. <coughs> Stray, in, in the, like, there have been shows before where you have, like, a left-wing asshole and a right-wing asshole, right? We could do a show. Like, I'll just take the left. If you want to play the right, you're on the right side of my screen, Maybe you can get like morph that into an Italian flag and you can get like a little statue of Mussolini. Just kind of pretend, you know, that, you know, you're just leaning away from me, right? You're like, I used to be near right. But once I met Alex, this communist fuck, I, I ran away from Alex as, as far as I could. Landscape. Yeah, that's how he that's how he did it too, right? Like he didn't operate as a fascist, like he, he didn't pay lip service to communism and then just be a fascist fuck. I will run shit. Because the people can't the thing you don't understand about the past that keeps changing is that the people never I was fucking talking. What is wrong with no, I'm not gonna if you cannot take the microphone, you fucking right wing hater fuck. I was talking. You have three more strikes. You don't have there are well, y'all do respect, you're my friend, but there's a ton of you in the world. You're not Stephen Hawking talking. What? But you interrupt. But you interrupted me. It's something that actually matters. You you don't. In the future, also when you say every every single time, you also sound like you mean the future. Savannah, he sounds like he means the future every single time because you're a conservative. All you think about is the past. All you think about is the past. If it didn't happen yet, it can't happen because because you live in the past. You live in the fucking past, and that's the definitive characteristic of conservatives. If, if, it, if it didn't happen before, it can't happen. If the world isn't already a sphere, it can't be a sphere, and Jesus is real. Fear is the mind killer. Duniverse. Don't say that shit to me. Jesus is real. <laughs> There are three characters in the world. There's three characters. There's Jesus, there's Santa, and Hitler. There's also wood, water, fire, and there's rock, paper, scissors. There's just Jesus, Santa, and Hitler. And only one of those is real. Stray, explain wood, water, fire to yourself real quickly and invent hand motions. Stray, you're not a bad guy, right? But you ain't 
top blue MAGA motherfucker. You ain't alpha top dog. And if you were alpha top dog, you'd be the most amazing guy in the world. I'm sure I make small mistakes, but like if generally I'm correct, if generally speaking, you don't want to let people into this country, generally speaking, you want to default to some idiotic bullshit political talk about we need a proper system for allowing immigrants. You don't say how many, you won't save families, you don't give a fuck. You think the past explains the future. You think the past is prologue. You are made of the teacher's that you had and your parents and the internet and the books that you read. You do not let you do not spend any time working for the future. You live in the past. You're trapped in the past. You don't invent anything. You haven't invented anything in 10 years. You live in your teacher's brains. You live in your elementary history school's brain and your mother's fucking brain. Invent something. You can draw Mickey Mouse and make money, but come up with something new. Show that you have an open mind. Show that you have an Get naked, motherfucker. Show that you have an open mind and that you're not actually connected to people who are hateful one step away. The past is fucking bullshit. Like, the only thing good about it is that it has, in fact, improved. You, you, you people, if there's a you people, you think the past is better. You think, you think the past is better. You, comma, you, you people believe that the past is better than the future. You think we have to go back. Conservatives think we have to go back. Liberals think we have to go forward. If you just want to generalize, I believe in the future. Conservatives believe in the past. The main reason like people get old and they look back and they're like, why, why was it good 60 years ago? Because you were young, that's fucking why. Dude, if we lost the finest, I'm jumping off the slippery cliff. Yeah, shit was, shit is, well, that's, 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 that's not a talking point. That's, that's what matters. Where the fuck is Stephanus? It's, it's like top of the list, right? Like it's the fucking top, like, right? Cause you need, cause, cause you don't want to buy a cheap beer. You want to buy a more expensive beer. I get it. And I, but I'm just not sure that these are, that these are. So what do you want to do? You want to go uh, all electric? What do you think? We should shut the fuck up. You don't fucking. They're, they're or machines like, do you know, do you know, do you know, we spend 900 billion, like, but you're fine with that, right? You want to stop them from building a war machine. You don't think the $900 billion American military machine scares other countries that don't always see us as being a genuine, I was fucking, I was fucking talking. I'm done. I was talking again. You, I'm done. You're so annoying. You don't, I think for a living, you just interrupt me whenever the fuck you want. Talk to stupider people, okay? It's fine.